See the game more clearly with high-definition spectacle lenses from Norville Opticians. Well, Mark, uh, Gloucester's efforts have paid off today. Yeah, absolutely. No, we were. I mean, it was a hard one out there. And I think I think the fans got value for money, but uh, it's really nice to be on the on the you know the right side of that one point or you know a few narrow victory. So we've you know in recent weeks and and, and also the start of the season we've been on the other side of that quite a few times. So yeah, it's massive for us as a squad to be on the right side of it. We seem to be talking about a very direct style of play up in the media suite at the top. You know, direct running, keeping the ball alive out of the tackle, which is just your game. You enjoyed that. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I don't think, you know, I think that is one of our areas of focus. I think uh, we're still trying to sort of find our way as a team. And I think that's evident, you know, uh, still a new back line being put together. But there's a lot of quality out there. And I think slowly but surely it's starting to gel. Defensively, it was a, it was a coordinated effort, particularly in the first half, looked very structured. Yeah, massively. I, I think against a side like that, that really likes to throw the ball around. You've got to, you know, you've got to accept that you're going to have areas where you're going to be under pressure. And and thankfully, we managed to keep them out in the first half when they looked like they really could have gone over. And that's just sort of credit to our defence and the hard work we've been putting in. Really, did they offer more problems in the second half, or do you think Gloucester mentally sort of stepped back a little bit because they certainly came back into the game? Yeah, I think uh, the, the, you can look at it both ways, but I think the fact that where we'd really, really gone hard for 40 minutes. There's always going to be areas of so we just may have switched off for a you know moment or two and they've back under the seats. Unfortunately, the far end of the pitch that could have gone to hand and we could have been away for our own try. So it's one of them 14 point swings, the, especially the second try. And, uh, and I guess it showed a lot of character in a, as a squad to come back from that after going you know, two tries in a minute. Made the second half very exciting for the people on the church line, a bit tense for those on the field. Though. Yeah, I don't, I don't think we want it to be that exciting. I think, you know, when we, we played really well in the first half, we managed to go in with a winning and, and we came out and we started really well. And, and I think when you get those 14 points, that really tests you as a squad. And like I said before, I know. I'm going harping on about it, but it just showed like the character we've got and we're building in it as a squad. I think it really was a testament to, to us as, a, as players. Well, you can see that at the end of the game, how important it was to the squad. And as you say, the coaches and the players we've interviewed after games have been talking about fine margins, small things that make the difference. If you had to highlight the things that made the difference today, what would it be for you? I think our, our discipline and I think, you know, maybe it's bad to say, but we, we got ever so slightly lucky. You know, Steenson rarely misses kicks, and unfortunately, the whole season we've been on the, the wrong end of those decisions or, or you know, bounce of the ball you know, at a point to last week. One bounce of the ball can cost you the game, and, and luckily, we were just on the right side of that. And, you know, for, unfortunately for Exeter, they were on the wrong side of it today, so uh, it's not something that's been going for us, but we'll take it this we'll take it today. Well, it's time to enjoy everybody enjoyed it on the side, so happy new year and thanks for your time. Cheers, man. thanks very much. Brilliant.